All right, hey guys, I'm redoing this video. I was recording for nine minutes and then I turned around to check how, how much time it, the video was running for. And, uh, and I've, and I've uh, you know, checked out the screen and I'm like, holy shit, it's in macro mode the whole time. So boy, did that feel stupid. All right, so this video is gonna be boring. So those of you that don't like Casper Ritis talking about nothing, just ranting about his life and adventures, then I suggest you look elsewhere because this is what it's gonna be. I'm sorry, but um, I just have to make this video since it's important uh, stuff, uh, well, in my opinion. All right, so let me just uh, be sweet and to the point and uh, get down to business. Uh, first of all, the knife making. I got some bad news, more bad news than before. Um, my knife making will have to go on hiatus for a little bit, probably until next summer, until after winter, at the uh, at the soonest. So, ouchie, that's not good since I love making knives and it's actually awesome, but uh, with these, you know, with just my environment and with the stuff coming up for me, it just. Uh, not impossible to like squeeze in the knife making in this in the schedule it just i can't mishmash it together all in one day it's just uh, impossible for me to do i just can't do it uh first off the roof that's gonna be a go but it's not gonna look uh, as how i wanted it to uh since my grandfather is being a stubborn geezer and he wants it done his way but whatever as long as the freaking roof functions and doesn't fall apart works for me just get it done whatever uh, so that's that you know, with the roof and uh, as for the knife making like I said I'll probably have to take a break for a little bit and go on hiatus with the knife making uh, since I have school coming up the it's gonna be coming up this Saturday on the first so that's that and I'll talk shortly about the pain in the ass schedule that I have well first off I, I'm going to be going to college every other weekend, so every two weeks, only on the weekend. Uh, so that's at least that's a relief that I only have to go every other weekend. Um, so that's that's fine for with me. But the schedule is from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. So eh, fuck. Uh, that's not going to be fun. I'm not looking forward to that. Uh, but hopefully it um, it's going to be. I don't know, a pleasant uh, experience, maybe. Maybe I'll meet some cool people, whatever. Uh, but also, and also if you're wondering about the beard and if you're disgusted by it, but I'm sorry, I'm kind of letting it grow out until tomorrow or a Friday so I can shave it and look good on Saturday. So I'm sorry, but I can be myself with you guys, so it's all good. And uh, let's see, what else was I going to talk about? Mm, kind of brain freezing here, kind of like pfft, skipping from one topic to the next. All right. Oh, and also I'll be getting a job. My buddy called me today and he was like, hey, I still have the job you uh, let down. Uh, do you want to work with me and I can still hook you up with it? So I was like, uh, yeah, man, hell, why not? So I didn't want to be disrespectful and he was asking for, for like, uh, since he needed more people to work at the, the job, so I was like, yeah, sure, man. I could use the extra, though. I, it's uh, it's always good to have extra cash in your pocket, right? So that's that. And also, uh, it's funny, kind of. I only made two knives, kind of. But I'm at least proud that I made the two knives and sold the two knives. I, I made a couple of knives, but I only sold two. I made one fully custom for one customer, and the other was a semi-custom that I just sold off to... Uh, to the person that was happy with it and wanted it right off the bat. So uh, thankful to those people. Um, enjoy it when you get it. Uh, <laughs> since you guys are going to be the lucky ones with the TLSK knife. Since I'll be going on hiatus for just a little bit. And also thank you to every one of you guys that uh, want to order a knife from me. With the like outrageous freaking ideas. Out of this world ideas for me to do for you. But uh, I can't do that for now. You gotta wait a little bit. So if you're still interested after winter, uh, P 
PM me, email me. You guys know my website. I'll leave it down below in the description. And uh, bookmark it, whatever. Email me whenever you're, mm, whenever you have a question or something, whatever. That's fine. And uh, that's about it. And also with the money I made from the uh, knife making from the two knives I sold, I used uh, some of it to treat myself to a little neck knife. And so that's going to be coming soon. Hopefully it's nothing too fantastic. <laughs> you know, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's a cool little knife, a popular little knife uh, on the, you know, just cheaper side, but not completely cheap like shit. It's, it's a good brand. Um, a well-known brand and a well-known knife so that's coming soon and also I had this uh, awesome comment from a youtuber uh, Stefan123321 he said in my last video with the TLSK last hope completed um, carving model knife he said good work Casper make a collaboration with Boker produce in Taiwan sell it for 35 euro and I will buy 10 of them and three people made that video thumbs up yeah, so that's a good idea man definitely but I can't I don't know where the hell do I find Boker's email I can't find it I know their phone number but I'm not gonna call from Poland that's ridiculous and I want to uh, email them send them a link to my video show them the design maybe send them a few pictures and stuff like that um, I don't want to talk about it over the phone I want to kind of send my uh, thoughts over e an email with drawings and sketches and the video like everything in one piece and like over the phone is kind of impossible to get my mind over to them it's better to show it on a picture so uh, but if it doesn't work out with Boker I don't know you can leave your suggestions down below what other knife company would want to have a little uh, would want to produce a TLSK last hope carving model neck knife you know just let me know and uh, yeah we'll see how it goes from there it's an idea it's uh, it's probably not gonna be realized or anything but hey nothing is impossible you gotta at least try so since I can't make knives 24 7 with my environment and situation you know I can at least have a knife company maybe collaborate with me and produce uh, at least one model of my knives um, in their factory since they you know specialize in that kind of thing so that would be awesome uh, and uh, yeah that's pretty much it that's all I wanted to share uh, school is coming soon uh, look out for a video from Gafco he's gonna probably show off the um, the TLSK Warncliffe and a little surprise I sent him he knows what it is but you guys just don't so you gotta check that out so he's gonna be making a sheet for you know, for the customer that I made a knife for and stuff like that so check out and be on the lookout for Gafco's videos he should have some of my work shown in his video so and that's about it guys I'm sorry for the long ass video probably this is going on for well not too bad compared to the last video the last video was like 10 minutes almost so I won't keep you you know bored for any longer stay safe stay sharp and uh, I'm sorry to have been rambling all this time Peace and uh, outski.